one of the most powerful things that I've programmed in Companion is VLC so that you can use it as a Hyperdeck equivalent without having to jump over into the actual software interface. Above my auto and cut keys here, I've got a cue and I've got a play. And I've also got up here VLC to take me to a whole menu here. Let's first of all jump into VLC and load up videos for the show, for example. Um, so I've got three here. I just got some drone videos that I cut and I've just labeled them one, two, three in the order of which I want to play them out. Just if you had like a run of show, it's um, these names will carry through. So you can see here, I'm going to put in NYC. NYC is loaded up here. Could drag in coast and could drag in Oz. We've got three videos in our playlist. All right. So what these buttons do is load up input four in the ATEM because that's what the computer HMI is coming into. And then it plays and pauses the VLC. So uh, I've got my coast video. I've got my Australian footage and then nothing in those ones. So if we look at our multi view here, you can see I am presenting in the, in the program. And then I could choose whichever video I want. Maybe I want to bring up the coast video. Let's start with the New York city one. It's in my preview ready to roll because I'm on this page. This is set to be a roll or to a roll cut. So at one press, it'll play the video and cut across. So then I could, you know, keep talking and then present that however I want. What's really cool here is you'll see Q1 is saying we're on video one and it's showing the time that is left on the video. So I know I can just, I can follow that and say, okay, I've got 10 seconds left. I got to get ready to get back. Uh, I'm going to go back here and what do we got? Five, four, three, and then, Hey, welcome back to whatever I'm doing. And now for the next thing. Also on my homepage, these buttons carry over. As I cycle through it, I've got each video coming up. So video one, video two, video three, and it's showing me the times on each of these videos. I've also set it up so you can preview it by holding it. So if you wanted to, if you press it down, you can see the video is playing here in the multi view. And then maybe you wanted to find a point and then you take your finger off. Okay. This is where I want to start it for this time. And then from here, I could just roll into the video from my home page by doing a play and a auto cut like this. And then we're off and away.